what's your area that you'd like to concentrate on? I'd like to concentrate on my bum cheek, my right side, and my stomach area. I'm Jordan, I'm 24, and I'm from London, England. I had my BBL done in Turkey, and I was not left with the asset I had paid for. And I guess you could say I was left with a catastrophe. Get it? Catastrophe? <laughs> my bum is just really misshapen, literally like an L, like an awkward. And because of lipo, my stomach is misshapen. There is this bulge at the bottom. Honestly, it's like I've had a child and I uh, haven't. As a child, I was like a human Pac-Man. <laughs> I just ate and ate and ate and ate, ate everything in my way. <laughs> when I was 18, I got obsessed with the gym. I would be in the gym every single day. I lost about 84 pounds. And it was like, ooh, I'm now getting a touch from boys. Just got all like excited with my life. I wanted the curves and I just, I couldn't get that in just the gym. But let me just go to Turkey and get my bum done. I had my BBL done in Turkey. This company organised everything for me. The surgeon was like, what do you want? And I was like, I want, like, Kim Kardashian's figure, like, help. Like, he was like, OK, no problem. They took back from my stomach, my back, and my face and injected it into my butt cheeks. So you've had Vaser on this twice. Yes. So you do have significant laxity. There are two solutions to this problem. One is a tummy tuck, where you make a very long incision from hip to hip, you elevate up the skin, and then you pull it down and tighten the skin. The other procedure is a full regular tummy tuck, where you tighten the abdominal muscles. If you do just a skin only, the recovery is very easy. It's unusual in a young girl to do muscle tightening, and the risk is elevated because of the increase tightening of the entire abdominal wall, which can squeeze off the veins of the pelvis leading back to the heart. And let's talk about the other situation, which is quite oh, challenging, nice. and that's the buttock area. Come on over here. What I notice on your buttock exam is that, you know, overall, you have a good shape to your buttock, yeah. okay? But the main issue is that you have some laxity right here. What is it? Well, that's, by the way, that, that <laughs> is the question. What is it? Dr. Bro, I need to know what is in my bum. There never is anything in my ass normally. Like, I'm just putting that out there, like, mm, mm So let me ask you, do you want muscle tightening with your tummy tuck? You yes, do. Yes. Even with the greater risk yes. and the longer recovery? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. The solution for laxity, loose skin of the buttock, is a potential buttock lift. Yeah. Sounds reasonable, right? The problem with a buttock lift is a scar that goes right across the back, just like a scar that's going across the abdomen. And here's the other thing. You ready for this? Oh, God, what now? I know. <laughs> the only way to do these properly is to two-stage them. You do one first, and then you do the other. The reason Jordan surgery has to be two-stage is that buttock surgery requires you to lay flat, and abdominal surgery requires you to lay in a flex position. So if you do them both at the same time, time, one's going to be sacrificed over the other. Go for it. <laughs> I go for whoa. it. I don't care. I don't, whoa, I whoa, whoa. I just, I can't, I can't have this. When I think about getting that full tummy tuck, that makes me think, oh my god, I'm so excited. It's going to give me the tummy that I've always wanted. Oh, there she is. Oh my god! <laughs> Hi. Oh my god, you're going to give us a spin. Oh wow, look at that bum. <laughs> Oh my god, your stomach is so flat, like perfect, like completely like smooth. Oh my god, like the lump is not there at all, like it just looks amazing. Sit down, sit down, sit down. Can you imagine if I fell over and I had to call Dr. Debro and was just like, hi, <laughs> can we redo all my surgeries? <laughs> I didn't honestly think that this day would come, to be honest. Yeah. But now, obviously, no more duck butt. Yeah. No more pouch, just kind of flat stomach, nice perfect bum. I'm just genuinely so happy. Yeah, that's so good. Before my surgery, I had a duck butt and my stomach had this weird bulge. But now, thanks to Dr. Bro, my waist is nice and tiny and I have a nice, normal looking bum. I finally feel like I've got my 24 year old body back and now I'm ready to show it to the world. My bum is no longer a catastrophe, it's more like an ass trophy. Ha, ha, ha.